I want us to all sit and think. When looking at stereotypes, when looking at culture, when looking at health, and I will put it out there and ask you, are women the victims or the perpetrators of this? Or is it really a combination of both? Women are the custodians in every culture of Nigeria. We're the ones who listen to our grandmothers who are told by the female members of our family what is expected of us, what we can do, and what we can't do. A lot of the harmful practices are actually perpetrated on us by our grandmothers. We talked of female genitalia uh, mutilation, female circumcision. This is actually not forced on us by the men. It's, we have documented evidence that it is perpetrated by grandmothers and mothers on their daughters, on their nieces, on their sisters. There are many reasons for this. Um, some of them being the fact that the women don't want to feel ostracized in the community. It is expected of them. They want their female children to marry well. It is a sign of a family honor. But how long are we going to continue this, knowing the harmful effect it has, including death? I think that we underestimate the power that we have as women. We tend to think that we are cornered by culture, society, what other people will think of us. We have no idea that if two or three women come together to say, no, you can't do this to my sister, you can't do this to my daughter, you'll be surprised. People will back off.